Georgia Democrats demanding that the governor launch an emergency legislative session to address guns. The reason? Well, it's hitting close to home for many of our neighbors tonight. Last week, four people were killed in two separate incidents across our state. One, you may recall that mass shooting at Northside Medical Midtown. Another three less than a day later in the city south of uh, the South Georgia city of Moultrie. Atlanta News first reporter Patrick Quinn joining us live from the state capitol tonight. And Patrick, Democrats, they're putting the pressure on Governor Kemp. How is he responding? Well, I reached out to his communications team today. Phones and emails, they have gone unanswered. We did hear from the governor last Wednesday. In the hours after the shooting in Midtown, he sent his prayers to the loved ones of those affected. He also commended the fast action from first responders. But in terms of the issue of gun violence, we really have not heard from the governor. All while today, we're seeing pressure from Democrats mount. Enough. That is it. We have got to do something. We've got to change these laws. Democrat State Senator Elena Parent says her call for change is inspired by the cries she's hearing from her community. And it's really, really devastating. And you know what? It's also terrifying. Now, a contingency of Democrats sent this letter to Governor Brian Kemp, insisting he launch a special legislative session solely focused on firearm-related public safety. Representative Greg Kennard was among those who signed on. I believe the shooting in Atlanta last week could have been detoured if there was a red flag law in place. Along with red flag laws, Representative Kennard wants to see cool down periods and better background checks for those wanting to own a gun. Just something to, to put a few barriers in place to prevent this kind of random impulsive gun violence is just perpetrating our streets. After the shooting at the Covenant School in Nashville in March, Tennessee Republican Governor Bill Lee called for a special session. That session has not started yet. Now Democrats here want the same in Georgia. We reached out to several Republican lawmakers and I called and emailed the governor's office for their reaction. I did not get a response. Senator Parent stressed public safety should not be a partisan issue. More and more Republicans realize how vulnerable they are on this issue because they are not on the side of public opinion. And even since the letter from that contingency of Georgia Democrats went out this morning, more have joined in. I'm told there will be a press conference on Wednesday here at the state capitol with House and Senate Democrats. So the ball is in the governor's court. We'll have to see if any change will actually be enacted. Live tonight outside the state capitol, Patrick Quinn, Atlanta News First. Patrick, thank you.